As urologists, we're always looking for better ways to identify the patient's actual symptoms. They can come in with urinary problems such as an enlarged prostate, and they, we obtain information directly from the patient. Sometimes that information is faulty, but there are emerging and new technologies out there to help us evaluate how a man is truly voiding at home and in the wild instead of just giving us a sample in the office. One of these technologies is called StreamDX. Uh, Dr. Jaffe has been using it for a while and he is uh, going to share with us his experience with this technology called StreamDX. Hey John. Hey. Thanks so, for doing this. Yeah, it's my pleasure. Um, I've been using StreamDX now for several months and I've been really happy because all of us have experienced Euroflows in the office and there's two situations. The patient comes in and says, oh, I just peed before I got here. And then you get this little trickle and it's meaningless. Or the patient comes in and they said, oh, I just drank two gallons and I'm bursting. And then who knows what that means because it's, it's not real to life. And so what I love about StreamDX, number one, it's going to quantify, so it's a voiding diary. So it's quantifying how often are they really going, how much are they going at each void. So are they going frequently in high volume or frequently in low volume? They don't have to write it down. It's right there. And then you see the actual stream each time. So you get real life when they actually have to go to the bathroom float. And it's great. And the printout is actually beautiful. So you see individual printout for each flow and then you see them all together and you see what their average looks like and you see a reality you know of the picture and very often it's going to tease out for you yeah this person really does have an obstructive pattern or you know what this person doesn't have an obstructive they have an overactive bladder without obstruction they don't need a bph treatment they need an overactive bladder treatment or or you know it it, it really can help you to you know tailor your your treatment to the appropriate issue. And how long have you been using StreamDX? I think it's been about two or three months now. Okay. Maybe even longer. Okay. And of course, everyone's going to be asking about reimbursement, making sure that for all the time and effort and the and the liability that you're going to take that you are being paid for. Yeah. So, I mean, it certainly is quite a bit better than a single Euroflow in the office because you're getting uh, five days in a row typically is the ideal. Um, you're getting that those codes. You're getting a telemedicine code. Um, of course, you know, like I said, you're getting a better test to begin with, so it's worth it for that. But you're analyzing a lot more data, of course. Absolutely, you have much more, you know, a much richer, robust set of data points to look at. So you really can discuss with your patient with good information, and it's definitely making more money. So I mean, payer specifically, it's it's going to vary, but it's certainly better than Euroflow, and in some t some cases, a lot better than Euroflow. And it sounds like a true win-win, right? It's good for the patient and also it is you're not losing money by doing this exactly yeah it's been really good i've been very happy with it all right so i look forward to hearing more about it maybe in a future meeting we can catch up but uh, for those of you who are interested um, i will put the link about a uh, the, the stream dx uh, product in the video description or if you're watching this on youtube it'll be up there somewhere on the card and i'll link it in the card all right thank you so much for doing this thank Dan. you john all right bye-bye